Welcome back. Welcome back to Maurice's Polo Review Channel. Today we will be talking about how to start your Ralph Lauren collection. Um, summer, spring is coming up, and I know it's going to be a lot of people out there who are trying to get into Ralph Lauren and start their own Ralph Lauren collection. Um, today I will be showing you a recent cop. Matter of fact, I cop them today. Spring is coming up, so rule number one. Um, when collecting Ralph Lauren is starting off, the basic necessities as far as clothing, as far as um, starting your own collection. First of all, first and foremost, the Ralph Lauren khaki shorts. I'm sure everybody who knows anything about Ralph Lauren knows about these particular shorts. And today, matter of fact, caught them at a steal. Boy. Um, for the hot $18, hot. Um, we went to TJ Maxx Home Good um, in Alcott Parkway. And I was searching and searching and searching. Of course, I'm on a polo hunt. And I uh, came across these. For 18 bucks, you can't beat them. Um, very nice, relaxed, you know, sturdy. You know, pair of shorts. I own. I own these now, and I own a darker pair. I got two pair of of khaki shorts. One light, one dark. Um, you want to be able to mix it up, especially with uh, graphic t-shirts. You know, Ralph Lauren is known for his colors. So you got your pinks, your greens, your blues, your yellows, reds. You got a lot of colors out there. And guess what? Any color you put with these is going to go. So that's rule number one. Rule number two is when you're looking for shirts, the classic Ralph Lauren shirt is this one. The red with the blue, with the blue polo man. This is a classic, iconic shirt from Ralph Lauren. I'm sure a lot of men have this particular piece in their closet. Even if they don't collect Ralph Lauren, this is a monumental piece when you're talking about Ralph Lauren. Like I said, whenever, anytime you collect, boom. With some loafers or, you know, some canvas shoes, chucks, or whatever may you want to wear. Air Max, whatever the colors, you can rock it. Um, those are two pieces. And this particular shirt I had for a long time, so don't clown me on it. But guess what? The blue with the red polo man. This particular piece has been in my wardrobe for the last past six years. It may be time to re-up on this guy, probably time to retire him, but my cleaners is great, <laughs> so I'm going to keep on rocking them. But this is another iconic piece in the Ralph Lauren collection, any man collection, start off collection, navy blue with the red polo man. This goes great with khakis. You ain't doing too much. Classy look, sleek, you ain't doing too much. Um, yeah, so this is what you want to add to your Ralph Lauren collection whenever you start off. Um, also, two more other pieces that I don't have time to get. A khaki Ralph Lauren hat with a blue polo man. Classic, iconic hat. That and a pair of chinos. So, with those five items, you're off to a solid foundation as far as your Ralph Lauren collection. Um... So, with that being said, if you're looking to start your Ralph Lauren collection, I would suggest that you get these, these particular pieces to add to your collection. So, let's talk about cops. I cop those shorts, and I went in today and I cop this dark brown Ralph Lauren belt out of Dillard's. It was on sale for like $45, and I'm just going to ask y'all a question. Do you think Dark leather looks better worn, like having for a few years. Certain, I'm noticing certain uh, pieces that I have, especially when you're talking about old leather, it looks better as it ages and as you use it. So <clears throat> I decided to add this particular belt to my collection um, just for a different look. But I have other Ralph Lauren belts, but this is this one I'm digging just because it got the Ralph Lauren polo embroidery on the side. Very dope. Um, let's talk about some recent cops. 
Um, this year, I'm trying to cut back on spending a little, especially when you talk about quality pieces. Um, Ralph Lauren, from what I've seen on the polo site, is about to drop a lot of heat. So that means a lot of prices. So with that being said, I'm going to cut back here and there. I'm just looking for quality pieces at bargain prices. Not going to lie. Um, this particular uh, rugby shirt, I got it for, I think, $45 off Macy's. I caught two of them. And yes, I somebody asked me a question in one of my uh, videos. Do I wear my clothes? Yes, I do wear my clothes. When I have time, when I'm not working, and me and my wife or me and my homies are going out to kick it, I do wear my clothes. <laughs> I just like my things organized somewhat to where I know what all I have in my closet. That way I can pick, pick, combine, boom, and go. <clears throat> so, with that being said, recent cop, Vintage piece, bow. For those who've been who's following me on IG, I posted this and I posted the vest that goes with this particular piece. As you can tell, it got 45 on the side. Very nice piece. Um, very detailed. You know, me and Dave Money I would talk about rugby's. So I just wanted to cop this one for the 50 bucks on eBay. So yeah. Um, also has the patches, the elbow patches on the side. It has 45 on the back. And this piece complements the um, vest that I have. So, um, like I said before, I'm looking for more bargain pieces that better, you know, the prices are reasonable and not paying um, a boatload of money for particular pieces. Also, go check out your local TJ Maxx, your local Marshalls before you start spending a lot of bread. Just a suggestion, you know, just go out and do a little footwork before you go, go on eBay, trying to find a particular piece when you can go to your local TJ Maxx and Marshalls and find it for the low because they, they really trying to get rid of this stuff. I mean, they got an ass load of inventory. So go to your local TJ Maxx and Marshalls. Um, also, speaking of, Clothing, we all invest a lot of a lot of money in our clothes. Understand this, we do. But also, we got to start start uh, protecting our clothing. So with that being said, if you go to your local TJ Maxx and Marshalls, and no, they're not sponsoring me, <laughs> but if you go, please get these particular hangers. You get ten for ten dollars, and you cannot beat it. I mean, do as you wish. I'm just trying to suggest things that will help you in the long run as far as your clothing. Wood hangers, because for some reason, them wire hangers, they'll leave like a bulge in your shirts and stuff. So I'm just trying to help you out. 10 for 10, you can't really beat it. Invest in your clothes with these. Um... Brand new year, brand new everybody right now. Everybody looking to lose weight, including myself. Um, yeah. So, with that being said, uh, you got to be more health conscious about what you're eating, what you put in your body, and also take your time out to uh, exercise and get your, get your weight back up, you know, start breathing right and everything of that nature. Um, so, with that being said, everybody knows that Nike basically has the best shoes on the market. So, what I did and what I've been looking for um, are the Vapor Max. Yes, the Vapor Max. It's crazy. When I tell you it's crazy out here, it's really crazy. People are paying $200 for Vapor Max. Don't get me wrong, they are a great shoe. Great looking shoe. A1. You know, but me personally, I'm not finna pay over $150 for no shoes. That's just who I am. Unless it's a, you know, a classic shoe, still not that, not a tennis shoe. I'm not finna do it. But um, let me show a cop. I just copped over the last few days. I love Vapor Max, but I can bring myself to pay $200 for these shoes. I'm not finna do it. So what I did, I went online. I bid it on some shoes, some Vapor Max. Guess how much I hit for? 
$90 for some vapor mix. And if you think I'm lying, I was sort of surprised when I won the bid because nine times out of ten, when you bet when you bid on Vapor Max, guess what? You lose the bid if it's up under a hundred dollars. But I won. So with that being said, boom. The Vapor Max utilities. Fresh. For the 90 bucks. You can't beat these shoes, and they're great looking shoes. I tried them on, I could wear them. Um, it's just something about the utility model that I like as far as Vapor Max. Um, great pair of shoes. You know, another great pair of shoes is the Rachis. Very comfortable whenever you're going a long distance, whenever you're trying to um, lose a lot of weight and you want your feet to be comfortable. Vapor Max, Air Max, Harachis. Cross trainers. They're great shoe. Um, and I just want to uh, touch on a few things. You know, I make content for everybody, not just one particular person or a few people. I just want to help you help yourself because at times when you talk to people, they don't clearly understand where you're coming from. You know, these are just clothes. Understand that. Clothes. They represent who you are as a person. Represent, but that's not who you are as a person. So understand that. Humble yourself because guess what? All this right here could be here today and gone tomorrow. So with that being said, I appreciate each and every one of you. Hit the subscribe button. Hit the like button. And till next time, be safe and be blessed.